Hello football fans, this video is about the latest summer transfer news going on 2023. We are going to talk about that. First of all, give us a like on this video. Drop your comment in the comment section. Don't forget to subscribe to the channel for more of the latest transfer. We are going to talk about Andre Onana deal between Manchester United. We are going to talk about that. Now, Harry Maguire to have spoken. We are going to talk about that and also top most expensive sign for this summer transfer this and other stories that we are going to discuss on this channel first let's start from manchester united manchester united i made a story on andre onana that things are going on negotiation are going on between manchester united and also inter milan on their goalkeeper that's Andre Onana now agreement for Andre Onana is 99.9 percent .9 to complete this deal. So next few hours, Manchester United they can officially announce Andre Onana as their goalkeeper. So that's the latest update coming in from the camp. So let's see what is going to happen. So the deal is set to be announced in any few hours. Okay, they can announce Andre Onana. So that's the latest update going on from the camp of Manchester United. Now Fabinho, Fabinho is a player for Liverpool. Negotiation is going on between Liverpool and Etihad. Etihad is a club from the Saudi Arabian class. We made a story, and this summer 2023, the Saudi Arabian clubs they are very serious in this transfer market. They are doing whatever they can to promote their league. That's the Spanish, uh, the Saudi Arabian league. So now a lot of transfer market is going on, and also Etihad they have shown interest in Fabinho. He's a player for Liverpool Football Club. So now negotiation is ongoing, and also the deal including installment payment terms and also more after the official proposal to be submitted so that's the latest update going on and now Harry Maguire. Harry Maguire is a fantastic captain by all standard for Manchester United. We made a story and Harry Maguire is one player that in this summer transfer, he is one player that in terms of transfer, his deals made a lot of complicated this summer. But for the club, two are ready to offload. That's Harry Maguire. And Harry Maguire too, he is not ready to leave. A lot of clubs have shown interest in Harry Maguire, but the player has refused to uh, just join any club. That's the latest update coming in. Even now, the latest news coming in from the camp of Harry Maguire is that the management and Harry Maguire they meet and also there was some a meeting that went on this is what Harry Maguire says after he was called by the management he said after a decision with the manager today he has informed me he is changing captain he outlined his reason to me and whilst I while whilst I'm personally extremely disappointed I will continue to give my all time where the shit so that's what he is saying for them he said the moment the management called him they said that they are going to change the captainship so for now he's not going to be the captain for manchester united game but he said for him he don't care either he is the captain or not so the moment he wear the jersey that's manchester united jersey he is going to deliver whatever he can he is going to do so that's the latest update coming in from the camp the, the team are trying as much as possible to offload but the player too said no i won't go so that's the latest update coming in from the camp now let's talk about the top 10 most expensive signing transfer so far the summer transfer 2023 a lot of clubs are signed seriously as i said it a lot are investing and said the others too are losing so these are the most top 10 expensive summer transfer so far that we I'm going to talk about that. So 10 on my list, I have James Madison. James Madison, he plays for uh, Leicester City. Now, the deal has been done between Leicester City and also Toria Ospreay. That's 64 million, uh, 64 million euros. And also ninth ish that's Matthias uh, Kunam. Matthias Kunam, also from uh, Atletico Madrid. Two was, that's 50 million. That's the latest update coming in. And also eight on the list, the eight. So I have Christopher Nkuku and also Manuel Ugat. Manuel Ugat from Sporting CP to Paris Saint-Germain that's 60 million euros and also Christopher Nkuku from Albi Leipzig to Chelsea Football Club that's 60 million euros that's over there so a huge man over there and also I have that 6 and 5 so the 6 and 5 is Sandro Tonari from AC Milan to Newcastle United that's 64 million euros and also Messi Mount that's uh, 64 million euros from Chelsea to Manchester United that's the latest update going there that we are talking about now the four and third on my list, the four and third, I have Dominic Soboslian from Albi Leipzig to Liverpool Football Club. 
have that 70 million euros and also that's Kai Havert from uh, Chelsea to Arsenal Football Club that's uh, Chelsea over there so Kai Havert also over there from Chelsea to Arsenal as I said it's 70 million so 70 70 for Kai and also Dominic that's the latest update and also second on this top summer transfer that's Jude Bellingham from Borussia Dortmund to Real Madrid, that's 103 million euros that Real Madrid they made before getting that Jude Bellingham is a fantastic midfielder by all standards. So now things are moving on well with Real Madrid Football Club. They have a lot of young players and also talented players as well. Now, first on the list, that's Declan Rice from West Ham to Arsenal Football Club. That's 120 million euros over there. And it's a huge money that Arsenal they paid before pursuing the signature for. That's Declan Rice, the latest update over there. So, these are the top 10, the most expensive sign for this summer transfer 2020 that we are talking about. Now, Chelsea, they have showed interest in and that's Romeo Lavia. Romeo Lavia is a player for Southampton. He plays for Southampton. I said it a lot of clubs, even Bournemouth, and also a lot are in fighting for the signature of Romeo Lavia. Chelsea, they have joined these clubs, and also Chelsea, they have shown interest in Romeo Lavia that they are going to try as much as possible for the cost of this month before the summer close. They are going to try as much as possible to get that's uh, Romeo Lavia from Southampton. So that's the latest update coming in from the now. Xavi Simon. Xavi Simon was a player for. Paris Saint Germain, and also later he joined us PSV Endoven. For his, his youth stay to he plays, he has played for Barcelona before he joined us. Uh, Paris Saint Germain now he joined PSV. Now, Paris Saint Germain, the latest update is that they are trying again to sign, re sign that's Xavi Simon, and this is how the deal is going to make now. Before Xavi Simon, he can join Paris Saint Germain. The latest update coming in is that two players out of these two players, one player has supposed to leave the club before this player can join. That's uh, Kylian Mbappe and also Neymar dos Santos Jr. So these players, if one leave the club, is definitely that Xavi Simon he is going to join that Paris Saint Germain. But if none of them leave the club, Paris Saint Germain they will buy him after that. Then they will loan him out. That's the latest update coming in. But if Mbappe leave this summer or this season or even Neymar leave it definitely this player they are not going to loan him he will stay at Paris Saint-Germain for the rest of the season or till other club maybe showed interest in this player that's the latest that we are talking about now before we leave that's Juventus Juventus and Barcelona negotiation is ongoing and also they are set for the negotiation with Frank Kessier Frank Kessier I've told you already that Paris and Barcelona they are ready to offload Frank Kessier and also other players but Frank Kessier he is leaving and Juventus they have showed interest in Frank Kessier so negotiation is going on between the two clubs so the idea is to have him join that's the form of loan so that's what the, 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 the team they are planning okay that's what they are planning with an option to buy so if for instance uh, Juventus if they had Frank C and for the uh, for the season his performance just shoot up is definitely like they are going to use the option to buy they are going to buy him for the next season so that's the latest update so negotiation between these two clubs is ongoing so let's see what is going to happen if Barcelona they will wait for this player that's the latest update of Juventus they will sign so we talk about uh, that Frank C for Barcelona and also we talk about Xavi Simon we talk about the top 10 that's most expensive summer sign this 2023 and also we talk about Harry Maguire he said for him he is still staying and also we talk about Andre Onan that's the latest update so it's 99.9 .9 completed for Manchester United this goalkeeper is a fantastic goalkeeper by all standards he know how to play the ball as usual like this video drop your comment in the comment section don't forget please to subscribe to the channel for more updates we shall meet later Subscribe to the channel and hit on the notification bell for more.